Alright, I'm gonna be going eating crackers. I ate some while I was waiting. How's everyone doing today? Yes, it is my Yakuzi. It is the greatest joke I will ever make. The greatest pun. I'm never gonna be able to top it. That's why I keep it on my stream somewhere whenever I can. It's been, it's probably somewhere in most of the Be Right There streams for, uh, I think since I put, like, made it in zero. Ugh. Anyway. Sorry for not streaming yesterday, but I was literally losing power, and I was like, I'm, I'm not gonna flicker on and off during a stream and ruin the game experience for not just me and everyone else. But, hopefully, it is time. Expose my balls live on stream? No. My si <laughs> Uh... 10. Maybe. Maybe 10. Don't worry. Uh, uh, after we're done with the streaming, I need to go back on and see if I can uh, harvest my tomatoes and corn. I did not max out my island in a single day. That was not me. I took three. I, I did three. Um... Just because it was like, eh, I'll wait for some of the other bonuses for building things and whatnot. I got to nine and then just kind of sat around for a while. And then I got to ten, I think, two days ago. But yeah. I will say the content, like, improvements stop at rank eight. Rank 9, all it gives you is one more landmark, and rank 10 is fly. But, like, everything else you have unlocked today. All the workshop stuff, all the tools, everything's at rank 8. Um, all I did, because I was fucking bored, I mapped my extra two buttons on my mouse to numpad 0 and numpad 5. And then also the numpad 5 one was mapped to sprint. And so I was just watching TV, and I would just, like, spin the camera a bit and hit the numpad 0 one, and then hit the numpad 5 one. And then with the two mouse buttons, you would run right towards it, and then you hit numpad 0 again. And it just did that while I was watching TV. Just mash numpad 0, and then 5, and sprint every once in a while. And you do that either underwater or by the dirt piles to, like, the south of the map. You don't even have to worry about anything else. Easy game. Am I included in Pat's roasting? I figure. He he told me that he said I was the crazy one, or he implied that one of his friends is the crazy one. And yes, it is me. Don't worry. I'm going to try to get the 17,000 sea cow uh, achievement. I... Listen... I had to make a spreadsheet for the animals, okay? Yeah, I, I linked a spreadsheet, we linked a spreadsheet for the fucking animals because it's crazy. Like, you have to go and find the right ones, and I still don't have the alligator. Ugh. Anyway. Anyway. I'm gonna start up Yakuza. I'm starting it up. We're gonna start playing while we chit-chat. See if it changes over. It doesn't break. Oh gosh, everything's moving. Come on, open up. Be correct. Oh, <laughs> the aspect ratio is not happy. <laughs> oh no. There we go. Oh, you have Asian short ribs. I'm fucking jealous. I have a. Uh... I have crackers and uh, some Mike and Ikes, and that's about it. I don't have Starburst. I have Mike and Ikes because Starbursts were like fifteen dollars more expensive than Mike and Ikes. But yeah, hopefully we should be getting the fourth protagonist today. And then once we're done, I'll go back to more. Uh... Actually, I actually don't have that much more island. I literally need to harvest those plants, and then I'm done. And I am done until. Um, like, Thursday. Because, like, 
you can set up all the the pre for the crafts to go, and, and then you can just set the little mammoth to harvest for you, and it's like okay, cool. Teriyaki's made of. Bleh. I don't want teriyaki starburst. Ew. No. Hey, hey. Yeah, I like basically finished the island. It's all good. Now it's nice and easy. I'll have a brick of ramen over liquefied starbursts. Thank you very much. Oh, someone's injured. Just to check, you guys can hear- well, there's actually no sound. Let me know if you can't hear it. Holy shit! How the fuck did you get out? Is it too quiet? I'm looking at the mixer, it might be too quiet, let me know. It's a bit quiet? Okay, hold on, we're gonna break the stream real quick. I'm gonna turn this up to there. And now you're gonna let me know, and I'm gonna deafen everyone, okay? Haruka? You. Holy shit! Hamazaki. <laughs> Smanena. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, actually, I don't know. Uh, I don't... I don't remember why. And my brain off. Did he do something? Yeah, he did something to hurt him. だつごくしてきたのか。どうして<笑> お前の名前を口にしていたんだが。その話本当か。ああ。そうか。最初のやつちゃんと生き延びていたのか。そうか。やはり知り合いなのか。その後無事に辿り着いたかまでは分からないがな。そうか。そうか。ああ、はい。The キル。あんたにどうしても頼みがある。何してるんだ。お前。俺は兄弟を男にしてやりて。だから頼む。俺の最初で最後の頼み聞いてくれ。So, how was Daki? What do you want? Well, it's kind of a long story, but Saijima He's the guy who bumped off Yoshi or Ueno, chairman of the Ueno Seiwa back in 85. Wait, wait, that's... Yep. You spend enough time in Kamurocho, you're gonna hear the story. Sajima killed 18 men all by himself that day. Well, that's what they say. 
Anyway, the two of us only just met, both locked up in the private prison that stones throw away from here. What, what do you mean, private prison? I mean, the government's not involved. They put the contract in place, yeah, but the private sector's been running the joint since the day they broke ground. They call it Okinawa Penitentiary Number 2. Taking you never heard the name? No. I had no idea a place like that existed in Okinawa. They officially call it a correctional facility, but that's a load of bull. It's a dumping ground for washed up Yakuza they want to snuff out for good. It was only a few days ago that, the Sa that Saijima got shipped down from wherever, whatever shithole they had him. Up uh, there. It was only a few days ago that Saijima got shipped down from whatever shithole they had him in up in Tokyo. My brain is like skipping words. Which is when you met. Bingo. And you two playing the jailbreak together? Uh, more or less. Though, I'm the one who came up with the idea, if I'm being honest. How'd you pick Sajima as your partner? Well, you saw him, right? That guy's built like a frickin' brick wall. More importantly, I knew what really happened back in 85. The truth. Go on. Back in the day, Sajima was a real tight with Majima. Yeah, that Majima. And that Ueno Sewa hit? When where Sajima slaughtered those 18 guys? That was originally going to be a two-man job. Saijima and Majima. Is that Majima and Saijima were accomplices? Yep. But the day of the attack, Majima never showed. That betrayal is how I convinced Saijima to break out with me. Explains why Saijima was talking about revenge when he was here. It's all bullshit, though. Majima would never have betrayed his brother. They were both set up. But by who? A guy named Shibata was heading up a third-tier Tojo family at the time. Problem is, Sajima and I got split up before I got to tell him what really happened. Ah, I think I can guess the favor you want. Yeah, you gotta tell him the truth, no matter what. Why is it so important? As it stands, Sajima's gonna try and kill Majima. Not only that, but, uh, but, but, I really respect him. He doesn't deserve to be living life in the dark, you know? Hmm. I mean, sure, I, I only asked him to help me bust out because of how tough he is. Uh, but he actually started trusting me during the escape. Uh, me, of all people. Uh, look, my life's been nothing but betrayal after betrayal. I've been on both sides of that coin. But two people looked beyond all that. They chose to trust me anyway. You and Seijima. I'm Zaki. I want another chance. To start over, be a true brother to a guy who went on a limb and actually trusted me. So I'm begging you, cutie son. You gotta help me. Uh, one question first. What's that? Why do you need me to do it? Can't you go and tell Sajin all, about all this yourself? Well, I. What is it? Namazaki? これは。あんたも関係したあの登場会の消えた100億事件。実はあの事件で動いていたあの金も沖縄第二刑務所設立の裏資金となるはずの金だったんだ。Wait. <笑> what is this wobbly filter? Wait, what is the wobble filter? Why? Oh no, yeah, the, the 10 billion from Yakuza 1 is there, but like... Why? Why did they add the fucking, like, super wobble filter over the past memories? You just, they add, like, the fuzzy, you know, ring around the outside of the screen, and that's how you know it's in the past. You don't make it look like I'm looking through a fucking bottom of a boat. 
A year back, when I was still suckling the Tojo clan teeth, I found out that the top brass over at the Tokyo PD had their hands dirty. Real dirty, with tons of shady cash. But you can guess where I learned all that. The snake flower. Yep. They've been lit. They've been working for one of the top men on the force for years. Laundered his money through foreign banks and everything. <clears throat> Why go through all that trouble, though? What did the police need with all that cash? What they needed was to build what one of their highest-ranking boys called their Utopia. Penitentiary number two. Oh my god, every single time. Every We talked about this last time I streamed, but the way that they have the, the, the back end of the code for the text here, every single time we're going to see penitentiary number two, it's going to be ten, penitentiary number two. Like, they're, they're, the two is the most important part of the entire phrase. And right again. The idea was, they'd build a place to toss all the convicted Yakuza they'd round up, then go and make deals with those very same Yakuza. What kind of deals? Stuff like bribing people to commit crimes. Then when the cops came in and saved the day, everyone would think they were the heroes. You know, crime would become a police-controlled affair. That's absurd. Yeah, an absurd power grab. Whoever handled those crimes would get big brownie points on the force. End up rocketing up the ranks. I still can't believe the 10 billion... I, I still can't believe the 10 billion Jingu was trying to launder through the Tojo. was supposed to end up with the cops. Believe me, I was just as surprised as you were when I found out. Even with the Nunny getting blown to high heaven, the paper trail on alone is some serious shit. Honestly, the only reason I grabbed this file in the first place is because I wanted a little bit dirt on the warden. Something I could use to bargain my way out of there, you know? But I gotta say, I never thought I'd stumble up on a shitstorm this massive. Mm. Almost feels like it's out of my league. Do you get me? I showed up at Tokyo PD's doorstep with his baby in tow, and that'd be the last anyone ever hears of me. Mm. Turns out this file's not the bargaining chip I was hoping to be. It's yours now. But why me? Because you were at the center of everything that went down five years ago. Hell, you even had to beat the shit out of your own brother at the end of it all. I mean, I did have all those bowling balls to help. Then... <clears throat> nah. Kid you? Come on, don't give me the silent treatment here. I just don't get it. Why'd... His mouth is not moving. Okay, why'd you show me that? I already told you. You gotta go to Kamurocho and tell my boy Sejima what really... There's more to it than that. I know there is. Besides, you would end up behind bars again in no time without this bargaining chip of yours. So tell me, Hamazaki, what are you really after?俺らが we gotta go back and save the, the Tojo from themselves and the cops. Haruka, have you learned how to walk like a normal person yet? Or do you guys still do the, st the stiff arm shuffle? Ah, oh, Tai Chi in the house! Yo! Ah, we're home, Uncle Kaz. Oh, looks like you kids had a good trip. Oh, you enjoy yourselves? Oh yeah, it was awesome. How we hiked, went camping, even saw some old bones and stuff at a museum. Wasn't it super cool, Koji? Mm-hmm. You gotta go with us sometime, Uncle Kaz. How was your grades trip, Ayako? How great! Who the fuck is that guy?
るか姉ちゃんこの子たちに近づかないでハルカおじさんは黙ってて私はねこの人のこと許したわけじゃないのおじさんは忘れたのこの浜崎って人は1年前おじさんのこと刺したんだよ私それ目の前で見てたんだよいや。We don't talk about that, but yeah. 俺は悪党だもんな。浜崎。悪かったな、はるかちゃんよ。その子たちに近づこうとして。はるか。もういいだろ。よくない。いいわけないじゃない。おじさんは本当に浜崎って人のこと信用してるのああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。Mark, York, York. Sorry, I'm out. You guys are still. Yeah, let's go! No, the dog's not coming. <laughs> Savage is tomorrow. I gotta find out what our actual raid time is. I don't know. Well, it starts tomorrow, and I'm all ready. You're going back to Camarocha, aren't you? I r e g e t I. I just don't get it, Uncle Kaz. How can you trust him so easily? He stabbed you in broad daylight, Uncle Kaz. He almost died. I'll never trust him. Never in a million years. Haruka, please. Whenever I see him, I just think back to what happened last year. What he did to you. That memory terrifies me, Uncle Kaz. Haruka. It's, I've always believed in you. You know I have. But this time. I'm really worried. It feels like if, I, if you go to Tokyo now, you're never gonna come home. You were just talking last night, huh? Maybe you want to know what happened five years ago, but I don't care one way or another. I just want you to be safe. You don't care? Haruka, you lost both your parents in that incident. I lost Nishiki and Kazuma s a n If there really was something going on behind the scenes, wouldn't you want to know what it was? Why is the water so loud? I. I'm happy just being here with you, Uncle Kaz. That's all I need. Not the truth, just you. Haruka. The water was so loud. Kiryu もう決めたんだ。俺は佐伯島に真実が伝わりゃそれでいい。それは他の誰かに頼むとしよう。だからキユさんよ、あのファイルのことは忘れてくれ。I cannot forget about that file. I'm the protagonist. あんたにはここでの新しい生活があるんだろう。でもそれじゃお前が。心配すんな。俺は結構しぶとい獄中で犀島の帰りをゆっくり待つとするよ浜崎俺は帰ってきたステーションに行くのかなあっそれでいいかもしれない I'll be seeing you, Kitty san. Hold on. Do you even know where the police station is? I'm an adult. I got eyes. I'll find it. I'll come with you, Hamazaki. We might have had our differences, but you at least deserve a proper send off after all we've been through together. Heh. <laughs> Suit yourself. Oh, yeah, let's go. I don't know what else I'm gonna do here. Yeah, let's do it. I guess it would let me save.
You sure about this, Hamazaki? 100%. The only way I'm reuniting with Saijima is when we're both back in the slammer. Hamazaki. Please, why won't you listen to me? My brother was sent to a prison in Okinawa. I, I know he was. You can say all. So you can say that all you want, lady, but I've never even heard of this penitentiary number two you keep going on about. Now go home already. No, no, please. You have to listen to me. I'm begging you. We already have listened. Oh, listen. I already told you. We looked through the logs of every prisoner shipped down here. Your brother isn't and has never been in an Okinawa prison. He is. I just know he is. Please, check for Taiga Saijima one more time. Please, officer. What? No. Huh? You're wasting your time. Oh, I'm tired of it. Wait a minute. Are you talking to Saijima Taiga? Yes. Taiga is my brother. ちょっと警察署の前では都合が悪いなもしよければ少しお話を聞かせてもらえませんかえもしかして兄のことで何かご存知なんですかああ場合によっちゃあんたの力になれるかもしれんとにかく人目のつかない場所に行こうお付き合いいただけますかはい about that. I helped your brother escape prison. This is really fucking... Look at that actual photograph in the corner on the wall there. What the heck is this place? The ex hideout of a family called the Tamashiro I crossed swords with last year. It's been empty for a while now. If there, if there is anywhere we won't be interrupted, it's here. So are you ready to talk? We might be able to find where your brother is if we can pool all the information we have. All right. Now, you said you were the ta you were Taiga Seijima's sister. That's right. My name is Yasuka Seijima. I haven't seen my brother for 25 years now. Every single day, I tried to visit him in prison. But they never once let me see him. Not a single time in all those years. Then, just a few days ago, I heard he was being transferred. To penitentiary number two down in Okinawa. Hmm. As soon as they told me, I left Kamurocho and raced down here. But no matter how many times I asked, all the authorities insist such a place has never existed. That's what we walked in on. Yeah. I'm at my wit's end here. isuka san yeah? Anyone told, who told you penitentiary number two doesn't exist either doesn't know the truth or is lying to you. It's real, right? What? I should know. I've been there. Y you have? Oh, yeah. They gave it some fancy name and number like a regular old prison, but it's not actually government run. You ever heard of a private prison? Well, of course. And that's what penitentiary number two is. Yep. Details are going to have to come later, though. I've got some more important news for you first. Truth of the matter is, uh, I know your brother. <clears throat> you you know Taiga? Mm-hmm. Oh, and uh, here's another grain of truth for you. Uh, he's long gone from Okinawa. Probably reached Kamurocho by now, if I had to guess. Uh, me and him broke out together a few days ago. You... What? He's telling the truth. Your brother washed up at my orphanage the next day, and I ended up giving him some money to get into Kamurocho. Sorry, Yasuko. You just missed him. In that case, I can't afford to waste any more time here. I need to get back to Kamurocho at once. What the fuck? That's a lot of doors. What do you do? What's that? 
Time to fight our way out. Let's go. She's running in heels, by the way. They're the guards from the prison. They killed every single other prisoner, only to chase after the two that escaped. So, he also didn't die. So that's the bitch who went running to the police, begging to see Saijima. Now, who are these guys, Hamazaki? Guards. From that shithole penitentiary I was telling you about. These pricks were the cruelest goons in the business. Heh. <laughs> Rich, coming from an escaped convict. Look, I'll go back with you. Whatever I gotta do. Just leave these two out of it. They don't got a damn thing to do with this. Ah, no can do. Don't worry, Hamazaki. We're not gonna kill you. But you're gonna need a serious attitude adjustment once we get back in the slammer. Might have to beat you till you change. Either way, this bitch the bitch isn't going anywhere. Why? This is between you and me. Ah, sorry, but Warden's orders. He told me to bring him Taiga Sejima's sister, and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Me? But why would... This is a load of bull. Hamazaki. Huh? Take care of Yasuka-san. What? What are you saying, cutie? I'll handle the guards. You stay behind me and keep her safe. Understand? Uh, yeah. Hear that? If you want to get to Yasuko, you're gonna have to go through me. And who are you, tough guy? Oh, someone who spent almost a quarter of his life in prison. And I can tell. You're no ordinary guards. <laughs> Step aside, pal. Or who knows? We might just accidentally beat you to death. I think you'll find that not as easy as you expect. <laughs> Your funeral. No more fucking around. Slaughter him. It's fucking like... We're gonna fucking kill him. Kiryu's fighting stance. It's a, it's a fighting stance. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Stop. Oh, my favorite character so far. I want to beat up all his goons first. Get rid of him. Just I want to get rid of all of the ones I can. I don't care. I don't care. I don't. I still don't care. Okay, good. Okay. Time for fun, huh? Great, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. There's the jumping flip. Yep. Yep, yep. Oh man, already. That's protecting her over there, by the way. Fuck. The heat doesn't matter, but... Uh, apparently it's... Oh! Oh, that's a new heat move part! The f it just completely jumped down on them? Okay. Oof. Damn it, you can't combo the kick. Oh, 
I was attacking the wrong direction. We can just say he's weaker because he still has the bullet wound in his stomach or something. Oop. He vanished! Uh, what now? What? Okay. Where, where, do I go down? I guess? Oh, yeah, okay. WHY ARE YOU THROWING GRENADES?! WHY IS A COP THROWING A FUCKING GRENADE?! Point blank! This track is pretty good though. Whoops. Wait. I guess they're supposed to be smoke grenades. Oop. Secret. bringing this with me. I don't care if I lose my heat gauge. Free healing, free healing. Oh! Chair versus chair! <laughs> oh shit. No! My chair! I can't get it! It's stuck behind him! Oh. Fuck. Ow. Okay. It's just a launch. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah! Oh, fuck, they went flying! Oh, he's got a gun, hold on. You know what that means? I get a gun. Why would he not shoot the entire time I'm running up to him? Oh, I got scratched my nose. Ugh. Here we go. Excuse you. Bitch. 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 Yep. Unstoppable counters. Or whatever. Uh! Okay, we need to heal up a little bit. He's got a little bit more damage than I would have liked. A little of this. A little of this. A uh, little of this. And then abilities. Uh... Makes it difficult to be knocked down. That's just a few other ones. Uh, don't care. Drop kick I have. Nice. Uh, yeah, double finishing blow is good. Counter target being knocked away. Eh. Ooh, no, maybe not. Ooh, there we go. I have it already. 
essence of jumping. Oh, these are all just the, the heat moves. What about these? Uh, enhanced escape. I have. How do I have all these? Up Is Kiryu a god? He has all of his upgrades? Like, I'm gonna need to get shot or something. And lose all of my upgrades, or else what's the point? Tried to fucking dodge, and it goes no. Oh, you don't play as QD that much, so he just starts with everything. Okay. Oh, the super punch. And then he just, it doesn't matter, he just dodges it. Ooh. Come on! My least favorite character in the game is always here to help save the day. Don't- oh, my chair! <laughs> I did not mean to do that! I did not mean to kick it into the wall and have it bounce back! We'll take it, though. Can you, like, turn, please? I can get, like, two hits, and then he starts to block. I just have to stop. I just- I rolled out of the way. We're gonna drink another one of the free potions I've got. Boom! And then the double- Ooh! Break his fucking face. into my foot. 
Salisbury has a chair lock in the last game, but still pretty good. And this is why everyone feared him. First of all, kill the guy, kill that, that guard, just get rid of him. Just get rid of him. あ、we're going to borrow a cop car. Thank you. Annie,あなたのような親友がいたことを誇らしく思います。やめてくれ。そういうの。Annie には必ずあなたのことを伝えます。I can't handle the flattery from a pretty girl like you. So,行こう。I I still can't get over that the two added the love interest. And then three went like, nah, man. She's gone. Here's the new love interest. Oh. Okay, yeah. The moment Cutie's off screen, his, like, healing aura leaves Hamazaki. And Hamazaki just dies on the spot. Wait, what? Why? <sighs> Leaving already, Machan? You know, Zao-san, you've been a better friend to me than I've ever been to you. Oh, don't be ridiculous. You know that's not true. I'm just sorry the truth turned out to be so harsh. Your father, murdered by another man on the force. I can barely believe it. You're telling me. Wait, didn't Zhao die? Didn't the corrupt, like, police chief take him and the girl into the here and shoot them both? Or am I crazy? Am I misremembering something? Because I thought that the end of, of uh, his arc was he fought the guy... Like, the, the one cop, it was like, oh man, I was hard on you because I was always crooked and all that shit. And then it cuts to his boss in this, like, restaurant being like, ah, shame. And then it, like, cuts to the street and there's a gunshot. I feel like I, I must be misremembering. Something about all this doesn't sit well with me. How will, we, how will your father's spirit ever find peace? I think he'll be fine. Hmm? Chief Asai, Sugiuchi-san, they were tired of being used by Munakara and Katsuragi all these years. Mm. The two of them spent their whole lives serving others. But their final moments, those were theirs, and theirs alone. They went out following their own brand of justice. Macha. Sugiuchi-san must have known. Nah. Sugiuchi-san must have known telling me the truth of what happened 25 years ago was signing his own death warrant, but he did it anyway. And Chief Hisai, he took his own life in order to spare you, me, and Meihua. That explains what he said into the phone before he shot him. Oh! So he shot himself. He grabbed Zhao and the daughter. And then went, all right, and then just killed himself? I, okay. Yeah. Chief Asai told Munakata I was dead, so he'd stop coming after me. He spared my life so that I could do what's right. So that I could do what, ne what he never could. You mean bring Muna 
Ugh. I cannot say that word properly. You mean bring Munakata down. Exactly. How are you going to do that, Machan? Munakata is one of the most powerful men in the world in one of the top police institutions in the world. Well, I don't think I'll be getting much help from my fellow officers, that's for sure. Time to go talk to a fucking oh. loan shark. Hey! Well, I am a genius! Ah, oh, Nihao! Akiyama-san! <laughs> Poof! Shit's really hit the prover proverbial fan, huh? Oh, you're telling me. Anyway, what's up? You wouldn't swing by here without a good reason. Mm. You know, sometimes it's depressing how sharp you are. What happened? Uh, district attorney's getting shut up in my office. Started tearing the place apart at the seams. Not to mention, they chucked me out of the street. Oh, wait, they're investigating Sky Finance? Let them look around. They said they're looking for some kind of coercion. The exact term's eluding me at the moment. Anyway, the issue is my tests. They said I'm forcing people to do stuff they don't want to do in exchange for money. Classic coercion case, I guess. <laughs> it looks like I can hear the words coming out of the DA's mouth himself. Anyway, I didn't know what else to turn, so I, f I thought I'd drop by here. Uh, looks like I caught you at a bad time, though. Want me to come back later? <laughs> nah, your timing actually couldn't be better. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I need a hand with something. I can't let son. There's too many cops. あんまり悠長にしている暇はなさそうだ。すぐにあんたのお兄さんを探そう。ええ。だがとりあえずその前にあんたに言っておきたいことがある。ちょっとついてきてくれ。why would you not have asked her at any point up until getting onto the streets of Ken you guys had to leave that one yakuza headquarters go back to your orphanage pack go back to the airport fly here take a cab here any point in time you could have asked your question for the most part in privacy too like like yasuka san there's a bar near here I used to go to back in the day. We can catch your breath there for a bit. Yeah, okay, I'll follow your lead. There are cops everywhere. What is this? What is this truck doing here? Is someone moving? Head up the stairs in the alley around back and tear Sky Flame into shreds. We're not leaving until we haul out every last document they've got. And whatever they try and say, just tell them we're under orders from the district attorney's office. Well, that's all they need to know. I gotta move on. The DA? I wonder what happened. They de-rendered and re-rendered there? That's it? No way! Are you just running the bar now? What? <laughs> He just took over the bar. <laughs> Don't this son is just like, man, I fucking love it here. Ugh, all the mamas are gone, though, so I'll just become the dad of the bar. Oh, what's going on, Kiryu? You? you show up in a guy's bar and don't even drop him a line first? Uh, sorry for not letting you know, Date san I have some business in town. Work never ends with the ex fourth chairman, huh? You've got that right. Anyway, this is Yasuka Saijima. I'm helping her with her a little, with a little something. It's nice to meet you. Oh, the pleasure's all mine. Yeah, I know, honestly, like, Date's got it fucking figured out. Of just like, I really love this bar. I loved it, it was great. I'm just gonna take it over in retirement and just run it. I don't care if I don't get customers, it's just gonna be me enjoying what I do. And like, oh, mwah, perfect. That's the dream. Now she's a knockout, cutie you. How'd you end up bringing a girl like her back here, huh? <sighs> Whatever you're thinking, I guarantee you've got the wrong idea. Let's leave it at that. Oh, by the way, where's Mama? Yeah, gone for the week. Family trouble, you know? Okay, he's just helping out. 
So it, it was literally like, hey, Dot, that you come here every week. I need to go home. You can take over the bar, right? Oh, man. Yep. And you're holding down the fort while she's gone? Yep. It's a real pain with my other work and all, but she insists we keep it open for the regulars. Well, lucky for us that she does. Now, key to you. What's this little something you need to take care of? Oh, right. You mind taking a seat, yesuka -san? Um, please. I just need to ask you something before we head out to find your brother. Okay. So, what is it you want to ask me? Sorry if this is a blunt question. But why do you need to see your brother so bad? Bad enough to murder for it? Oh, uh, wait, you're what? Kitty san is this really the best place to- Don't worry about Date-san. He's an ex-detective, yeah, but we can trust him. I promise. He never turn on he never turn you in without hearing what you had to say first. Isn't that right, Dante son? Uh, well, uh yeah, that's right. Uh, tell me the truth, Yasuka san. Why would you go so far for your brother? I Yasuka san. Come on. It's because because Taiga is everything to me. I own my life. What? I'm serious. If it weren't for him, I would have died years ago. Go on. Have you ever heard of a living donor kidney transplant? Oh yeah, you read about those all the time. That's when they get you. Uh, that's when they give you a kidney from one of your relatives, right? They say you only need one after all. Right. The truth out of the, the truth of it is, I'm the recipient of one of those living donor transplants, and your brother's the one who gave it to you, huh? That's what you mean when you said you owe him your life. Like, oh man, he. Donated his kidney. Now I will murder for him. Heck yeah. Also, thank you very much for the sub. Five months, that's one more than the numbered entry of the game. You're right. Uh, 6.2 is very fun, although I... Uh, I have completed the content for the island. I have completed it. I got a lot of grinding to do, but... I'm level 10, so we're good. That's what I mean when you said you owe me life. Yes. H hold on. Getting a transplant like that from your sibling isn't all that uncommon. So I'm not judging or anything, but do you really own that much just for a kitty? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Dot. It's just, do you own that much? Like, come on. It's not that simple. I think you can explain. Uh, the kidney I got, it wasn't... Uh... Then why do you owe him every anything? Well, yes, but... But what? Why couldn't you get the transplant from your brother? suko san I, uh... I think I get what's going on here. You and Taiga aren't actually siblings. Kitty! Oh, he's right. Taiga is my stepfather's son from his prior marriage, well, my mother had me before she and my stepfather even met. Then where did you find a match? Oh, since my mother had already passed. Taiga tracked down my biological father and begged him to donate his kidney to me. Saijima. Beyond the regular difficulty of finding a kidney donor, my blood type is extremely rare. A direct rel relative was my only hope for a match. Once Taiga learned that, he spent every waking moment of his life scouring the city until he found my father. Well, he was only 15 years old at the time. Still just a kid, huh? I had honestly given up hope. Before my mother died, she told me my father was nothing more than an abusive drunk with no chance of ever changing. Based on what I knew, it seemed like he was already dead. Even if he wasn't, I didn't want to know it well if knowing I owed my life to such a horrible man. At the time, I would have rather died than continue on carrying a part of him inside me. But Taiga wouldn't take no for an answer. He said no matter what happened, he would take care of me. Then, he found your dad? Yep. Well, where was he? In Kansai. He had started working for a Yakuza organization called the Omi Alliance, handling the dirty jobs no one else wanted to touch. The, the Omi? That's right. Taiga went alone to Kansai, knowing full well that my father was Yakuza, but let me guess, they tried to extort him. Exactly. A Yakuza threw him through, my father demanded a massive sum of money in exchange for one of his kidneys. How much cash are we talking here? 30 million yen. 30 mi- That's a ton now, but it was a fortune back then. How was a kid ever supposed to get his hands on that kind of money? He was That was the point. But Taiga didn't give up. He started fighting thugs in the streets of Kamurocho, trying to scrape together whatever funds he could. That would never work. Not for a cash at that. It didn't. Not until Sasai-san of the Tojo clan stepped in. He gave Taiga the 30 million under one condition. He joined the Sasai family. 
So that's how he ended up in the Tojo. All that time, Taiga never turned his back on me. Even when he seemed like all hope was lost, he supported me. He dropped out of his high school, gave up on his dream of becoming a teacher, and he even joined the Yakuza for me. So that's what you mean when you said you owe him your life. That's right. He's everything to me. Not only did Taiga literally save my life, but he gave me the will to keep on living. suko san He just takes a fucking swig of his drink and like, damn, that's serious. あたしにとってお兄ちゃんはお兄ちゃんだから。あんたにはここで待っていてもらう。少しこの店で頭を冷やした方がいい。え？あ？何言ってんだ、キリュ。こんなに切実に会いたがってるってのに。安子さん、も
You know the rules, Yuya-san? If a customer ducks out on their bill, it's the host's responsibility. Mitsuru knew that when he let his girl run on that huge tab. You're not wrong, those are the rules. I've seen it happen time and time again in this biz. And sure, I'm being easy on Mitsuru. But he deserves a little slack with how hard he works. Besides, the kid's a real high earner for us. We just gotta let this one mistake slide. He'll learn from it, and we all get, we'll all be better off in the long run. But for now, yeah, of course I'm gonna help him. And what, Stardust is just gonna eat the five million he lost? We'll pay it, don't worry. Just not yet. Hitting him with all that at once would, would bankrupt the poor kid. Oh, come on, are you gonna bail ev everyone who fucks up from now on? Stardust will go under in the blink of an eye. Kazuki-san would never have let this bullshit slide. Ugh. Hey, Yuya. Problem so big you need to take it outside, huh? Holy fuck, it's Kiryu! you san you son! I didn't know you were back in town! Just for a bit while I take care of some business. It, 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 the thing is, it's not even the hostess with a dude, it's a host with a girl. Which is implying the girl left. Like, it, is he supposed to assault her? Or it's like, what? Like, bar the door and prevent her from leaving? Like, it's gonna be a matter of... I mean, the actual answer is, if you don't know them, you can't let them run up a huge tab. Like, that's just how it is, because you can't trust them. Like, what's gonna happen if they just run out? Like this... Well, I would have dropped by with a gift or two if you'd let me know first. Heh, <laughs> don't sweat it. We've known each other for too long to be worried about those kinds of formalities. By the way, how were things going at the club? You and that kid don't really look like you were seeing eye to eye. Ah, sorry to see that, kitty son So, what's going on? Oh, it's his host we have, Mitsuru. He let one of his customers run out of a, a 5 million yen tab. That was just a pretty common thing, though. It is. Mitsuru is one of the hardest working we got, too. And I can't even begin to tell you how much business he's brought in. He just got kind of unlucky this time. So I want to give him a hand somehow if I can. That's the, uh, that's the Yuya I know. I just don't know, kitty san You think I'm too soft on them? Shinria seems to think so. Pretty sure Kazaki-san... Nah. Pretty sure Kazuki-san called me soft at least once, too. I just wanted to help my host out really too bad. Yuya. But hey, you don't need to hear all this. I should be getting back inside anyway. I gotta do my part to keep Stardust a top host club in Kamurocho. I appreciate you lending an ear, though, kitty san Thanks. Hmm. Maybe I should head inside and see what Kazuki has to say about this. Look at all the studs here. The th the the uh, the all the real people, and then the two character models. Like those are just real people, and I would hazard a guess that some of them are pictures of the same people. But then you've got the two fucking CG character models there, too. Yo, they changed the fucking tile, I think? And the coloring? Nice. Been a while, Kazuki. Hmm? Holy fuck, it's Kiyu san! It's How are things going? It's tough. Well, enough, I guess. You guess? Are you worried about what's going on with you, Yen Chindra? Yeah, that is, that is... those are devs. Uh-huh? You heard about that? Yeah. I saw them going at it outside the club earlier. Oh, sorry to see that. Not exactly the image we want to project to the world. Uh, even though he's the manager now, you can still get a bit hot under the collar at times. Well, I wouldn't worry about it. He's nice to see a man have passion for his work, and it seems to me he has it in spades. I'm gonna take a drink of water real quick. No, uh, agreed. That's why I chose to let him take over as manager. I knew I could count on him when things went south. Speaking of which, what do you think you should do about the whole tab situation? Like I said, he is the manager now, so I fully stand behind whatever decision he makes, of course. But, but what? Well, a lot of times when a host lets a customer run up a big tab like that, he has some kind of ulterior motive. Oh? That's my opinion, at least. No matter how young, green, or easy to manipulate a customer may be, it doesn't make sense to advance someone that kind of credit. Five million yen is no small amount. But still, it's not unheard of. Well, true enough. 
Usually, though, it's a case of the host needing to boost the sales figure. The easiest way to accomplish this is to pressure a customer to ordering pricey drinks. But for some reason, I don't believe that was the case this time. Honestly, I have the feeling that Suri was set up. Set up? Who would do something like that? Oh, that's a good question. Uh, even if I, that were the case, though, I can't simply take matters into my own hands. You use the manager, which means he's the one who needs to handle these kinds of problems. I guess what happens to Mitsuru all depends on your skills as a manager, then. You know, at times I think you is too kind for this job. Uh. Maybe Kazuki's right. Sometimes Yuji is really too nice for his own good. That's it? That's where the side quests... Uh, well, wait, but... But, what? What am I supposed... What? <laughs> it's just, wow, yeah, you look really nice. That's the end. Okay, never mind. Bamag here. It's been ages. Kiryu, if you're here in Kamurocho, come see me. I'll be waiting at my dojo in the Dragon Palace. I'm... I feel like that part, the, hey, my apprentice thing, is like, I have not been doing any of those dojo side stories because everything I've heard about them is, yeah, no, they take forever to do. So I haven't done them, and I've been missing the part of, oh, yeah, he is, like, super genius, and we are his apprentice. Right? I'm gonna have to, fuck, no, 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 we're not fighting, no, 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 no. Nope. You know what I mean? I'm just like, yeah, I don't know what the deal is with him. Why is there a cop? Hey, don't mind me. Kazuma Kiryu-san, yes? Uh, who's asking? My name is of no importance. I take it you read the email. Please, step inside. Guess I'm going in. Who is it? Hey, cute you. It's been wait. I'm waiting. Do I know you? Hey, <laughs> I'm not surprised you don't remember me, but I've had you in my brain nonstop these past four years. Don't tell me you forgot what you said to me. You feel like swinging the bat around, and we were gonna be, we were gonna be the cur. Wait. If you say so, I said a lot of things to a lot of punks. Oh, that didn't jog your memory? Well, the nickname stuck with me ever since. I've been having guys call me Curveball for years. Think, man. He got in a fight with the gang here called the Bee Kings, and I'm their leader. Or, I was, at least. Alright. You're the one who went after Takashi when he w tried to lead the gang. Oh, yeah! I think I did some of this. Yeah. I thought you were just some random punk. Looks like you've done pretty well for yourself in the meantime, though. I take it those are your fans outside? <laughs> you bet they are. I take it you don't keep up with this kind of stuff, so let me fill you in. These days... Everyone knows me as a professional baseball superstar, Keisuke Baba. I've made more TV appearances than I can remember. Oh, yeah. Yeah. In other words, I don't have a lot of open slots on my schedule. And here I am, asking you out on a dump like this. You know why? Uh, you said in your message you wanted to settle things. Oh. Well, that's right. It's been gnawing at me all this time. You tried to make me out to be the bad guy back in the day, but Takashi's the one who made me the wrong choice. That's when I decided I was going to prove that I was right. Everyone needed to know the truth. So you started playing baseball? I don't think I see the connection. Uh, of course you don't. You see, the very concept of right boils down to nothing more than whatever the powerful says it is. You've seen those self-help books where successful people tell you how to be successful yourself, right? Having power makes everything you do valid, man. As long as you're powerful. Right and wrong don't matter to you. Everything you do becomes right. And whatever came before was just a step into your path to, to success. Yeah, right? He just went from, like, just a thug to I'm in the, like, superstar baseball guy with fans following me around. So by becoming famous and uh, rich and famous, I'm proving that all the twists I've made up till now are the right ones. Uh, that's the same kind of logic you got your crown knocked off in the first place, B-King. Uh, finally remembered, huh? Ah, uh, good. So now what? Don't tell me you want to slug it out again. Mm -hmm. I told you, I'm a major league. Li uh, I told you, I'm a major leaguer now, and there's only one way major leaguer settle things: with a bat and a ball. 
Here, I'll make the rules simple for you. I throw ten pitches, and if you can get a clean hit off of even one of them, you win. Fair enough? Sounds pretty generous. I can close my eyes and swing randomly, and I'd probably still hit at least one. <laughs> Not against my secret weapon. You can't. Swing all you want against my twisted curve. You'll come out empty every time. Oh, shit. We need a Poo's home run derby. Let's go. Eagles it. Fuck you, bitch! First try! <laughs> Easy! I have played Winnie the Pooh's Home Run Derby. You can't fool me with your fucking magic ball. What the? Looks like I win. <laughs> You're really something, you know that? The most pros can't even sniff out that pitch, but here you are whacking it around like it was a freaking softball. Hey, Mike. Yes, Baba-san! Why are your eyes bugging out, sir? You look like you are high as a kite. Fucking laser beam's gonna come out of those eyes. Oh, get me a ticket to the bet. I gotta do some baseball soul-searching. Looks like I gotta embrace my inner curveball. What? what about your TV interview? Or the piece you're going to appear in for that magazine? Yeah. I'll cancel them. I mean it. Next time I see you, cutie son, I'm gonna be a changed man. Don't you forget it. But I'm not gonna go shaking up my style because of one little loss. If anything, I just have to dive deeper into what I've already got going. Maybe my logic's not all there or whatever, but I'll show you how I got the goods. Eh, anytime. You bring the most twisted curveball you can throw, and I'll still knock it straight back at you. Yeah, right. Later. People found a Lilo and Stitch home run derby? Wait, what? I might actually have to check that out. Oh, man. Oof, Cosmo Kiyu, was it? That's me. Allow me to thank you. Baba-san has truthfully been in quite a massive slump lately. I can barely believe how just how excited and full of energy he is now. It seems Baba-san really looks up to you. If you ever run into him again, I'm sure it would mean a lot if you gave him another run for his money. Please accept this as my thanks. A chunk of... Here, have, have a fucking block of sacred wood. Now then, I have a swath of angry journalists to call, so if you'll excuse me. Sure thing. Tell Bobby to take care of himself. Have a chunk of religious wood. We ripped it out of a shrine when we were praying there. I saw it, and it looked wonderful. I was going to make a cabinet out of it, but ugh, you know how it goes. There are cops fucking everywhere. Fuck, he wants to talk! No, 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 no! We have already seen that quest. I don't want to do that side quest. I really should. I probably should have done it a bunch of times already, but whatever. What's this one, though? Just calm down, okay? It's normal to feel crabby when you're hungry, because their brain speeds up the release of adrenaline as it tries to raise blood sugar. That's not very informative. In other words, there's a whole lot of adrenaline running through our systems right now. If you get what I'm saying. Something wrong? Huh? Oh, is it really nothing? It's really nothing. Okay, it, it, it's actually something, but I'll take care of it somehow, if you're sure. No, wait, sorry, I really, got, I really do need some help here. What kind of help? Uh, you, you see, I was just about to deliver these guys their lunches. I work delivery part-time. Uh, thing is, I crashed my bike. Uh, you know, totally wrecked the thing. The lunch just got wrecked, too. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. First of all, quit dragging random people into this. You sure know how to cause a scene, kid. What? Wait! I'm sorry, buddy. Don't worry about this. No, 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 no don't go. Help me out here. Hey, man, how do I keep getting dragged into these things? Are you surely sure these lunches are ruined? I guess the rice is still pretty much edible, but uh, the side dishes are a complete loss. And nobody wants a lunch of just rice, right? Sure, it's it's simple and zen and all that, but you gotta have side dishes. Obviously! And why don't you go pick up some side dishes around here? Uh, it's gonna be expensive, and it's your responsibility after all. Oh! Man! that That is, like, uh, the perfect idea. Why didn't I think of that? Uh, you're a genius, man! Oh, good one, buddy. 
All right. Well, good luck, kid. Th uh, thanks, man. Ah! Uh, sorry. Uh, looks like I hurt my leg in that crash. Ouch. My leg must be broken. It hurts like hell when I put my weight on it. If it was broken, you couldn't stand up. Anyway, I really feel bad asking all, but would you go get the food for me? Sure. I guess I gotta see this through. Fine, kid, I'll help you out. Oh, really? Oh, dude, you you mean it? Oh, this kid is starting to get on my nerves. What kind of lunch was it supposed to be? It's a curry lunch. Like I said, the rice is still okay. It's just the sauce is a mess. Curry, huh? So I guess what I should go look for then. Oh, sorry, buddy. I really hate to pull you out like this. Yeah, sorry about this, but could you just make it quick? Yeah, yeah, just wait here. Hmm, curry. I'm pretty sure there's a restaurant or something around here that has it. Map. Zoom in. This one? Conright? No. On Tom? The only one that's near here is Conroy, and I don't think they have it. We'll just go see, though. You found some... You found some Asher Rock that's all mythical and stuff. Where'd you get it? Turn the rock into a bandana? I fail to see how that is physically possible. Let me get around this pole. Hey. I. Oh, okay. That's not the right one. Um. Not Bon Tom. Maybe Kyushu number one. Let's go to Kyushu number one. He wants to fight. We're not fighting. Where? This way. We slip into this alleyway, right? And it's in here. How can this not be good enough? It's X. Wait. We definitely saw this one already. Okay. Well, okay, this noodle. I'm a huge fan of this place. I remember. By the way, who is it just now? Your apprentice. That's right. His name is Matsuyama. He's young, but he's got determination and skill. He really mastered a ramen. I came to see what in the future, but you don't want him to open his own shop. Well, that's. I'm sure it's not. That you don't want to expand, I guess you have your own reasons. Would you like to talk about it? I'd like to help, of course. I hate to burden customers with our problems, but I suppose I can tell you. Let's see if it's plenty good, that's for sure. But do you know, think there's any point in him just making the same ramen as I do? With the skill and intensity he's got, he'd like to see him make something on his own. So you think he ought to open his own... So basically, he needs to make his own branch style. we pretty sure we saw this. Can you give me curry ingredients? Okay. Uh Which shop has curry? Club Shine, no, no. Maybe that one. Let me check what the, the sub story says. That's not the sub story. What does the sub story say? This guy can't do shit on his own. Guess I'll go pick something. To, I'll go pick some curry for him. Wait, what did it say for the one? Okay. Shit. I walked too close to Millennium Tower. Alright. 
It's now raining. Well, shit. Okay. マジマのおい、どこ行く勝手に動くな。何があったんだ。うまいこと この Thank you for the one bit thuggins. I appreciate it. <laughs> and we had to bump the minimum bit up to five. Five times the price. Can't believe you didn't insult me like this. I'm not even gonna read it. It just hurts. My feelings. No, I don't want anything. I'm, I'm good. So Five cents from Fuggins, that's it. Agatta. It's only Fuggins. Saijima Yasuko no Sosaku are more de Haizumida. Ato are lay no file of Ima Dogoni Arka. Sorio Sagajida. Ah, Tanodazo. Soja. Anata no Gokyo Ryoku de Majima o Taiho Zurugo de Gibashayo. これでマジマ組の邪魔が入らない。感謝します。さあ、あとはあなたがどう決断するか。それだけです。数日前の上の聖和会との構想それに五年前の百億事件すべてがあなた方によって仕組まれていたことだったとは未だに信じられませんだがそれが真実ですもう迷ってる時間はありませんよ<笑> 6代目 私はね、道島さん。極道組織というのは社会の必要悪だと思っているんですよ。敗戦後、日本という国の復興を陰で支えてきたのは警察と極道です。それは間違いありません。我々警察は目に見える犯罪から一般人を守り秩序を築いたそして極道は目に見えない外敵を水際で叩きこの国を独立国家として成り立たせただからね私は警察だけが正義だなどと言うつもりはありません警察と極道は今の今まで常に表裏一
Tomoni on a Jimicho Ayun Dictano Discara. Right? That's crazy. Daga Jidaiwa Kawata. We don't need the Kakusa anymore. Only the police. 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 しかしそれでは何かとお互いに都合も悪いだから私はそれを本来の形に修正したいだけなんです。あなたさえ良ければ、上の清和会は責任を持って潰します。公の力を使ってきれいに。裏を取り仕切る組織はあまり多くない方がいいその条件が荒井というわけですかええこの荒井を新たに若頭に昇進させて我々との窓口にしてほしい組織の運営は荒井が取り仕切りますあなたは六代目として登場会を守ることができるどうでしょう so, Arai was always a cop plant. Always. 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 私以外の警察上層部との取引の材料を確保するためにね。材料。Like Kazuma Kiryu。Oh fuck no。Not the florist。Wait what。25年ぶりの再会だな、サエジマ。Well, fuck. Oh, no! 年は取ったが、その目は変わらないな。<笑>なんでお前がここにおるんや。話すのも面倒なくらいいろいろあってねまあんたもいろいろ真島さんから聞かされただろうお前の目的はなんない俺のこと拉致して何になるんやまあ心配するなすぐにあんたを殺そうってわけじゃないあんたにはまだ生きていてもらうよどうせ殺すんやったらはいやれこの世にまどろっこしいことして時間使うぐらいやったらいっそ死んだ方がマジやほほずいぶんと潔いな覚悟はできていると当たり前じゃボケが俺は死刑囚や25年前のあの日18人も殺した時から覚悟はできとるフフ<笑> 18人殺したね何がおかしいんじゃあんたは何にも知らなかったのかあの25年前の事件お前は誰一人殺してない何言うとるんや俺なんだよ18人殺したのはお前は誰一人殺すことすらできなかった。ただのマナー。I mean, he did go in fucking guns blazing a Kimbo style. どういうこと And like take on all of them and knock them out with his super police bullets. まあ、そのことは後でゆっくり教えてやるよ。時間はたっぷりあるからな。Where this guy just went and popped them when they were unconscious. 俺としたことがちょっと計画が狂ってしまってね。最初は警察とつるんでこの上に立ってるビルをいただくつもりだったんだが
予定を変更せざるを得なくなったんだよ。荒井って男のせいでね。荒井やと。荒井ってあの、ひどの兄貴分。どういうことやまあ事情はゆっくり話すとして、あんたとあんたの妹さんにはまた協力してもらうよ。妹やと。お前、安子をどうするつもりやおっと。まだそんな元気があるのか安心しろあんたたちは今の俺たちの生命線だ殺しはしないさあんたたちと例のファイルそれにあり余るほどの軍資金さえ手に入れれば宗方など用なしだどうだ金の方は準備できたのかええスカイファイナンスの隠し金庫にあった現金1000億おい無事強奪に成功しましたお,お前はお久しぶりです西島さん Are you fucking kidding me? I can't keep track of who's on whose side anymore. Every time I see a character for the second time, oh, they've changed sides. They were evil the whole time. Majima san said Yasuko san's in danger. I have a bad feeling about this. Better get back to New Serena and make sure she's okay. But I have to fight Curry. Well, no Curry, I guess. He wants to fight. We're not fighting him. Unless you do curry? Just imagine working at a restaurant and some like big tough Yakuza dude walks up and you're like, ah, oh, anything to order? And he goes, no, I'm not hungry, and walks out. Do you do curry? This is just sushi, isn't it? There we go. I'll just grab four of them. There are four guys. Alright. Listen, I know it was like super important, but. Where? I'm, I'm all from around. Hold on. This delivery guy does not get his own chair. He doesn't get to eat. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Not fighting you. Okay. Where are these guys? Fuck, don't tell me they're gone. God. Who do I give this curry to now? Who do I give the curry to? I've just got curry in my inventory now, I guess. Nope. I'm starting to be able to tell who wants to fight and who doesn't in this. Or at least a good enough estimation. Alright, new Serena, let's go. Better than the old Serena. Ah, fuck. Ah, great. What the? Date san! Date san! Date san! Ugh. Good, looks like he's coming too. Date san! 
Hmm? Oh, key to you. What happened? Are you okay? I think so. Because I blacked out or something. You sure you're okay? Oh, my head's still fuzzy as all heck, but yeah. I'll be fine. Do you remember what happened? Well, you and I had that chat outside, then I came back in to keep Yasuka's Khan company while you were gone. Next thing I knew, I was waking up on the floor to you screaming. You don't remember anything else? Oh, wait, uh, now that you mention it, Yasuka's Khan poured us a couple drinks when I stepped back in. Drink. You think there's a chance he drugged you? I can't rule out the possibility. They're still on the counter if you want to have a sip yourself. I think I'll pass. Anyway, do you have any idea where yasuka san might have gone? Uh, not a clue. Sorry. Damn it! Look, I'm sorry. I was ready to throw down if some thugs barged in and tried to take her away, but I didn't think yasuka san herself would be the one fighting me. Uh, it's not your fault, Latte san Guess I should probably get looking for her, though. I'll be back. Wait, Kiryu, I'm coming too. No. I need to stay here in case she comes back. This is probably the safest place in town at this point. Oh, you're right. Well, good luck out there. Thanks. I'll be back soon. Um, um, um. I'm gonna eat my crapper. Um, um, um. No way but forward. Gotta get to Yasuko san fast. Where did she go? I wonder if she's gone to Millennium Tower. The Majima Cone, let's go. Somewhere around here? No. Am I supposed to just run around until I find her? Like, no guidance? It's just, oh, she's out there somewhere. Wait. Fuck, nope. 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 Are the curry guys here? Nope, no curry guys. Yeah, the, the fucking sax is going crazy. Wait. Fighting. Yep, nope, 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 nope. No fighting. We'll just run over here to see, but I don't think it's gonna be here. But I don't know where she would have gone at all. No trigger. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, he's throwing up on the ground. Just PG version. Nope. Uh, maybe she went to that bar that she worked at? He wants to fight. Stay clear of him. Where- where did she go? She worked at this bar, I think, right? No, I'm not enjoying the club today. I'm looking for a person. I thought they worked there, but I guess not. No directions of where she might have gone. The only place I can think of is inside uh, Paradise, and I don't want to go in there. You want to fight? Yep. Fight? Yep. Where the heck is she supposed to have gone? You guys know? I... I guess not. You wanna fight? Yeah. 
Oh, I couldn't avoid him. One of my top three favorite ice cream players. Hold on. Come on. Bop, 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 bop. Bop. Done. Um... I would say... I would say Cookie Dough is up there. I would say it's probably third or fourth. I am a big fan of, uh... Um, Ben and Jerry's uh, cherry flavor one, and then if if I have toppings, I actually really just like French vanilla with some like good toppings. You know what I mean? Where it's not overpowering the flavor, but you got French vanilla with like some good cherries and a little caramel and you know other stuff like that that you put on top of it. I know very basic, but like oof, it's so good. The issue is when you get all those toppings and then it's like some really rich flavor underneath and it just overpowers. It's ugh. But French vanilla with toppings is like the best. I got a dog shit Asian digital watch. Where the hell did she go? The real issue though is I usually shop at uh, Aldi's and Aldi's is like a. Uh, like, just kind of, you just get what you get, you know? Ooh, with walnut? Ooh, that's good. You want to fight? Yep. You can put, like, almost anything onto French vanilla, and it's just going to be good. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. I'm going to just... I could go into paradise. I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Like, it's not just this. They could be on the- she could be on the rooftop, but she could be underground too. Like, I don't know. Cookies and cream is really good, um, at times. I've had real bad cookies and cream, too, and it's kind of annoying when you get that. Um, bad cookies and cream is when, in my opinion, like, the cookie part of it is, like, chewy gooey, kind of. I, the, I need the, the cookie part to have, like, a little bit of a crunch to it, you know what I mean? Or else, what is the point? What is the camera doing here? Okay, so we know it's not in there. You know what I had for ice cream when I was way younger? And when I was younger, it was the, like, top three ice cream, like, might even beat, uh, fuck. Might even beat cookie dough, um, for cookies and cream. Oh. Uh, there used to be an ice cream that was Rollo ice cream. And if you don't know what a Rollo is, Rollo is just chocolate with caramel in it, right? And all it was was a chocolate ice cream with caramel swirls and chunks of Rollos in it. Like, just regular Rollos. And it was, like, the best ice cream. Now, you couldn't put it on a pie or anything like that, but, like, oh, man... I, I don't know why, but, like, the just having a Rolo in it. Because anytime you get, like, oh, here's the, the M&M ice cream or something like that, like, half the time, it's not a good, like, candy to pick. And half the time, the candy choice and the ice cream choice don't mix. But just 
a smooth caramel and chocolate ice cream combined with like a kind of good candy. It, oof, it was good. Stop grabbing me. Stop grabbing me. Do anything. Stop grabbing me. Do anything else. Stop grabbing. God damn. Grabby Gary's over here. Can me over here, maybe? I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I have to assume she's not in a building. In here? Nope. Well, yeah, I haven't had the roll of ice cream in forever, and like every time I try to look for it, people either don't know what it is, or it's just not like, like a thing. Like, I haven't had it since freshman year of college. Or like, Ooh, that's. Love in heart, okay. Uh, like, people just either have heard of it or just this doesn't exist. So. I have tried Moose Tracks. I don't know why. Moose Tracks were not as good as Roll of Ice Cream. I'm not sure. I think the issue with me is I would like vanilla ice cream to have, like, fresh toppings, not toppings that are mixed in. So, like, the issue with a lot of the times with, uh, when they're mixed in is they're also, I mean, obviously, they're gonna be cold, they're gonna be frozen. And there's only a few toppings I've had in the ice cream that's frozen that I like when they're also frozen. Usually it's when their texture is not the same as the ice cream, like with the Cherry Garcia, Ben and Jerry's, or the um, Rolos. The Rolos were literally just like they were regular candy for some reason. I don't know how they didn't make them like crunchy with how hard they got, but it was fine. Like, don't get me wrong, Moose Tracks are still up there, just not like top five. I probably put it underneath just strawberry ice cream. Because strawberry ice cream is good. I'm just gonna have to go check behind Serena. I don't know where the heck she would have gone. Did I miss a thing? Am I supposed to know where she's gone to? Because, like... She vanished. Right? She drugged Date-san, and then Date-san's like, yeah, I got no idea where she went. Well, he's dead. We don't know where she went. I unless I missed like a line of dialogue. Like did she just go into Sky Finance? Nope. Is she on the roof? Okay, apparently, the rooftops in Kanorocho flood <clears throat> during the rain. Which is not a good thing to have happen. Like, get any sort of drainage in there, you know? Do you know where? No? Wait, is that... How? How did I miss that? The entire time! Oh my god, it's because I went like this and went that way, and I guess the trigger never happened. Oh my gosh. There she is again! she going? Where the fuck is she going? Is 
She's taking the weird path because they need to have her dip out of sight because they don't want it to be a chase sequence. But they want it to be a chase sequence without the chase mechanic. Those two guys are also running to Children's Park. Oh! The manhole is open. How convenient. Oh, it's them, okay. どうやらすぐそばまでやってきてるな。ああ。上の俺の中かもしれない。ここは俺らで食い止めるしかないだろうな。ああ。安子さん。あんたは先に行ってくれ。Do I have to fight the other two protagonists? この奥さん。no no 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 That's a bad thing. Anta mo Kamuro Chou ni sunde tan nara kiita koto krai wa aru daro. Ano homeless no tamari ba datta Nishikou e no chika no koto da. Doushite soko e. Man, just imagine the rumors of yeah, under the homeless camp, there's like a fucking turbo brothel fight arena. Mukashi no homeless nakama kara kiita. I would assume not everyone knows about the surveillance hub, but I mean, if you've been there, you've seen the like turbo brothel. Or you've gone for the fight to the death oh. arena. Akiyama san mo, Tanimura san mo, kiyotsukete. Ah, sorry, Jack. She's running real well in those heels. Oh my god.上の聖和会のやつか。それとも宗方の使いのやつか。何を言ってるんだ。あの女をどこにやった。リリちゃんならとっくに行っちゃったよ。何？あっと、ダメだよ。これ以上先には行かせないよ。安子さんには指一本触
fucking not fair. Why is he getting his heat look too? Stop using your heat move on me! Alright, we need to do a little of this. I'm actually kind of too low. Wait. Oh, right, the wood. Can I just eat the ramen? <laughs> you need to eat the, sorry, you need to eat the curry for a bunch of health. I should go back and buy more curry. Stop, stop, stop with the combo. Stop. Stop. Can't stop me. You don't know what my next move is going to be if I just spin the fuck off. Fuck off. Ho ho Dummies! Alright. Get fucked, bitch. Now I have heat. What the fuck knocked me down? What? Oh, they both have heat moves now? Cool, okay. Oh, right, he could just do that, still. Oh, stop, 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 stop it! No! <laughs> you can just grab me all you want now, I don't care. Okay, stop, okay, stop, stop. Stop. It's just annoying. Bitch. Fuck. Fuck. It's too early. Bitch. Fuck! Oh, you just punched me through my kick? Oh my gosh. We need to eat. We need to eat something. Just a little... Weird. There we go. Okay, okay. What the fuck is with the stun? Bitch. Get down. Bonk. Oh no! And then Kiryu takes them both and throws them into the sewer. Sir, this is not a good one. Let me give you a hand. What is this? This guy. Need to find Yasuka-san fast. Someone around here must have seen her. Whoa, Kitty-san! I never thought I'd run into you down here. I didn't even realize you were back in town. Oh, do I know you? A uh, posture check. Okay, hold on. Ugh. Hold on. I need to drink some water, too. And then I'll eat... I'll eat two of these Mike and Ike's instead of a Starburst. I'm out of Starburst, but I hope it's a fair trade. Do I know you? <laughs> as much as you know any other home, any old homeless guy, I guess. I know you, though. Oh, owe you a lot, in fact. You helped me out down in Purgatory before the Hills Project kicked off. Then out there was the whole snafu of the Dragon Palace. Huh. Well, alright then. By the way, 
Or any one of those puppies if you want to keep going. You got a manhole opener. This dude hit you here a little bit any old manhole you come across. Though, some guy came through earlier, pried the frickin' thing open with his bare hands. Hardly believe my eyes. Alright. Don't ask how the girl got through. And now she's gone. Kita was on the wrong side the entire time. Forest cannot die, it's not allowed. Chain of betrayal. It's fucking baby. Yeah, bunch of babies. Pansy. まさかこんなとこにあの大先輩がいるなんて思いもしませんでしたよ。ある意味ここ数日で一番の驚きです。何言ってんだ。元刑事が分野でクラブの手伝いしてじゃ悪いのか。いや。ただこの数日間毎日
六方全書か。Don't tell me the fucking key to the vaults in the fucking league. I don't know. Now that's a fucking vault. Why does it not have a lock? Don't tell me it's just all cash! Oh my god! Are you fucking kidding me? It is all cash, and the safe is unlocked. Like, that is the equivalent of keeping a billion dollars inside your office in the middle of, like, like, just two streets off of Vegas or the fuck, right? I don't even know. Like, two streets off Vegas, keeping it unlocked. Like, there's no passcode or dial or anything, and it's just, like, the button to open it is fucking behind a book. Yeah, but... Like, <sighs> you deserve to lose all that money at this point. You really think that's how it went down? I、oh, can't think of any other way. Me and Hana Chan are the only, one, only two people who knew about the vault. Kido chan's the only other possibility. What makes you say that? Well, it would certainly wrap things up nice and neat. Everything would make sense. What do you mean? Not long after Hana chan saw him at the office, Kido chan got hauled off by Hatsushiba clan boys who'd been working with the Shibata. We just walked in and spirited him away. Simple, clean. What's so strange about that? Everything. You'd understand if you've seen what Kido chan could do in a fight. Go on. Well, it's only been once I've witnessed it myself, but the guy came off the floor with anyone without even breaking a sweat. He's pretty coy about it, though. He prefers to keep all that under wraps. How come? It'd be better for the family that way. Most likely. Kind of more enterprises for Kyu Chen and Arai San work is a tiny speck under the big Shibata umbrella. Now that you're usually Yakuza outfit and make their living off the dramatic displays of strength, but not Kanamura. Why not? Oh, didn't want to stand out, especially with the rat race always tearing down this town apart. Guess that's how he was. Oh, makes sense. It's safer to lay low and just get on with your blade than start bashing heads in. Yep. Kanamura couldn't even afford his dues to the Shibata. Came to me begging for a loan and everything. Spanning his turf and inviting competition was probably the last thing on his mind. Well, I'm sure he was more than happy to keep his head down and let Kanamurocho be Kanamurocho. Oh, for sure. That's why Arai san and Kido chan were so careful not to make any waves. But yeah, Kido chan's a monster. You think he let himself get kidnapped on purpose then? Oh, you bet I do. By the time I got back to the office that day, he was already gone. The place is more of a mess than usual thanks to the struggle. It was convincing, honestly, but one thing stood out to me. Which was what? The order my books were in. Your books? Yep. Kido chan tossed a bunch of them around, probably to make it look like a fight went down. Cover his tracks, you know? But the ones that were still on the shelf weren't in the right spots for some reason. That's how I knew something was up. <laughs> Hold on, your office isn't exactly what I'd call organized. Not by a long shot. Also, I see that sparkle on the lamp. Are you seriously telling me that you know where every single book is supposed to be on your shelf? Every single one? Good morning. Whoa. 
Long story short, my old pal Kito-chan pulled a fast one on me. What I really want to know is, who keeps a hundred billion in cash just lying around in this day and age? Why not stash it in a bank? Oh, don't trust him. Besides, it's not like any of them pay decent interest anyway. Not much physical money isn't exactly portable, though. How'd they get it all out? I asked the DA guys who raided my office yesterday. They're the ones who did it. You think they were imposters? Oh, big time. Katsuragi must have sent them over once Kido-chan tipped them off. That would explain it. Life's a cruel mistress sometimes. Ah, uh, sure, you get used to the cheating and the backstabbing and the lying in my line of work. But when it all smacks you in the face one after another, oof. You seem like you're taking it pretty well, though. Yeah, most guys would go into total shock if they lose 100, 100 grand, let alone 100 billion. I am in shock. This is me in shock. It's not that big of a deal, I know, but still. Not that big of a deal! I'll just make it all back again. But... <sighs> and hey, this week has been had its head... The week has had its highlights. Oh yeah? Well, I met you for one, cutie son. Uh, is that really so special? You're my freaking hero, man. You saved my life. Uh, did I? I think I remember that. Just listen. You know when the Millennium Tower blew up the five years ago? When all that cash ran down on the city? That day changed my life. I grabbed as much as I could. Gave myself up. Went from homeless bun to this in practically no time flat. If not for you, I'd still be on the streets. Digging through trash just to keep myself alive. That's the money you built your business on, huh? Yep. Though now that I think about it, that 10 billion was probably the same cash my bank duped me into laundering for them before they had me take the fall. The 10 billion Jingu diverted to the Tojo clan. So, yeah. This all feels kind of personal somehow. If this stuff's gonna go down is linked, if the stuff going down is linked to that 10 billion, consider me there. Just reach through his jacket to grab that. Right? We learned in Yakuza 0 how to use your money to make money. We learned it. Buy every single business in the entirety of Kamarocho and then turn it into a real estate enterprise. I don't know about you guys, but this is starting to feel like fate to me. Almost like we were all destined to end up here. Fate. Hmm. You might just be right. But there's a fourth empty seat. Where one was missing. で、これからどうするんだ、お前ら。最初またやすこを取り戻すつもりなのか。ああ。それしかないだろうな。だがどうすればいいんだ。金はすでに葛城の元にある。やはり奴らの居場所を探して直接攻め込むしかないのかいや策はあるんいや he made a billion or hundred bill in like five years they can just do it again just do it again man これって何なんだ動かぬ証拠というやつだおそらく宗方も葛城もこのファイルの行方を追いかけているこれを使えば奴らと取引できるはずだ Now we go to the news and just hand the file to them. How'd you end up with this thing, Kiryu? Hamazaki gave it to me down in Okinawa. It's a document showing the creation of penitentiary number two and the expected money of the flow of money into the place. Huh. Well, you look at that. It's got names, amounts, everything. Yeah. It says right there that 10 billion yen that got transferred from the Tojo to Kyohei Jingu back in 2005 was meant to get passed on to the Metropolitan Police. That's the incident you wrapped up in, right? right? Kitty san now here's the question. Why the fuck did they... Is it, like, the only thing in that ledger, though? The, the ledger's empty otherwise. Right. That missing cash nearly tore the clan apart. And the guy behind it all was a man named Kohei Jingu. Haruka's father. But there's more. There are notes in here detailing a police plan to release inmates for penitentiary number two and create artificial crime. All to make the police look good. That's one hell of a scoop. No wonder they're so desperate to get it back. This goes public, all their dirty laundry will be out in the open. So what's your next move? We try and cut a deal with Katsuragi. 
I just need to figure out how to get in touch with them. Well, I can help with that. He and I have talked on the phone before. If you call him for my cell, I'm sure he'll answer. Huh. Mind if I borrow your phone then? Yeah, go right ahead. This is gonna go poorly. Katsuragi. You there, Katsuragi? じゃないのか。俺は桐生ってものだ。今分け合って谷村の電話を借りてお前に電話している。桐生。まさかあの四代目の桐生和馬さんですか。そうだ。これはこれは驚きです。それで私に何か用でも。西島大河と安子のことだ
I don't think anything we say is going to change his mind. Isn't that right, cutie son? Oh, that's right. Deal's a deal. Well, I should probably get going. Be careful out there, cutie. I will. <sighs> oh, okay, I can buy drugs first. Oh, boy. Oh, cutie, you. You're on your way to Camarocho Hills? Why am I not surprised that you know that? Ha! <laughs> it's all part of the job. Anyway, I know you already know this. But you can get to Camarocho Hills via the bathroom in West Park. Doubt you'll forget that anytime soon. But yeah, thanks, florist. Does Camarocho Hills, like, ever get fucking finished? Because it was a park, and then it's been, like, a real estate development empty lot for, like, two or three games now. But it's supposed to be, like, big fancy, um, like, real estate here. Fuck off. Don't make me eat curry. You wanna do that all tough with the bat after I do a flip kick onto you? Bonk. Bonk. Oh, what's up with that dude's jaw? Oh! That dude's jaw was like busted open! Cool. Yeah, cool. Where's the drugstore again? It's like up there to that other, like, caddy corner in this or whatever. The opposite corner, I think. Yeah, that's where it was. God, there's cops everywhere! This, this, this town sucks now. Hey, it's my favorite area. Hey, buddy. How's it going? We are going to buy... Ten of these. Thanks. And then we're gonna go eat some food. Why does Kidu have this much? Because... screw it. Wait, can I go finish the fucking curry mission now? I mean, I ate some of the curry, but maybe I can go finish the curry mission. Oh. So yeah, there we go. I had to come here. Okay. I had to get quest curry. A fucking... Oh my gosh. Time to go back to fucking... New Serena to heat up the quest curry. No, I'm not fighting you. Come on, guys, we gotta heat up the quest curry. Not that you might have to borrow your stove. Not much of a choice, I gotta heat this curry up. What? Thanks, it'll only take a second. You heated up the quest curry box. Sure, no problem. Help yourself better hurry back to the construction site with my now hot quest curry. Nope, 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 nope. Can't catch me in the digital man. I'm out of here. Oh, this is also a fucking curry. Eat here. I'm not- what? Am I not hurt? Oh, I'm not hurt. Okay, I thought I was hurt from that fight. <clears throat> I guess I like- Oh! Because I entered the hideout, I regained all my health. Everything's coming up nice. Out of my way, out of my way. Sorry, buddy. You would- Face first in that girl's chest. You're welcome. <sighs> okay, is it 
Hit twins? Is it up here or was it around the corner? It was one corner over. I have brought you all quest curry. Hey gang. Oh dude, you're back! What happened to the curry? Hand over the large curry take-home packs. Oh sweet, you brought enough sauce for everybody. Nice and hot too. Man, you're what heck of a guy, you know that? You really took care of business. Yes, curry! Finally it's here. Curry! Curry! We love curry! Ha ha ha, yeah. Huh. Boss, isn't it a little too early to celebrate? Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Sure, we got our final like curry, but the real question is, does it taste any good? It's not over. <gasps> Hungry! Crap. The curry we ordered was supposed to be from a famous curry shop. But how does this curry stack up? Maybe we should taste before we get too excited. True enough. I don't know what I've done without that sharp mind of yours. The assistant foreman's right. It all comes down to the taste. Don't think you're out of the woods yet, boy. Okay. How was it? It's fantastic. Tastes great. Yeah, it's delicious. Yes. Dude, they like it. <laughs> That's a relief. Man, you are like my idol. I don't think I could... What is he doing? Why did he like jump up and then pat the ground? I don't think I could have done this without you. I thought your leg was broken. Uh, it's a miracle. It feels better now that I'm so pumped up. If you say so. Uh, dude, thank you so much. I should have totally asked before, but what's your name? I'm Tamoya. Because of a key to you. Key to you? Got it. Man, even your name is badass. I really wish there was a way for me to thank you, but this is all I got. Super stamina. Uh, we'll send back the sacred wood. Good enough. Be careful not to crash your bike again. I will. Take care, Q son. Alright, we had our break. Now, back to work. Oh, the foreman's cracking the whip. <sighs> I should... There's nowhere near here to save. Uh, whatever. I'll just do it in one shot, you know? I'll just, I'll just do it. Let's see. Anything in the one I haven't... Oops, some things in the one I haven't gotten. Let's just grab those. Uh, these are all the heat moves. I don't really care about them that much. And let's get them. And we'll see the, the sound get real weird there. All the twos are gone. All the threes are done. We just have fours, which is... Yeah, these are going to be, go finish the Komaki stuff, which I probably might not do, but we'll see. Nope, 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 no time for you. Head to the roof! Oh, we got the music coming in, too. Alright, this guy's got a gun. I need to take him out. Oh, that was not a gun. That was a sword. Bam! And he's done. Whoa! I feel like fighting the dude with a sledgehammer is a bad idea. Why was I locked for so long? I don't even want to think about what how much damage that sledgehammer would do if it hit me. Okay, not that much. Oh! Transmission all over the fucking fight! I need a mod that whenever I jump it does the fucking um, DBZ 
noise. You know the one. Just bear. Like, this is the kind of fighting, though, that, like, the game is really good at. It's, like, this fight, like, ten dudes kind of thing. Even though I'm now saying that as I just eat sledgehammer hits. Come on, buddy! I'm gonna get the sledgehammer? Okay, fine, whatever. I get, uh, one more throw of this blade, though. Yeah! Oh yeah, that's the- fuck it! Get back here! Alright, that's- that's it? Wait, that's it? That's all you- okay, no, good. Pardon me, I need to, uh, grab this real quick. Toughness is easy, easy, easy. Oh, my heat gauge. Looks like I'm gonna have to go in through the front. Bear. Bear, bear, bear. That mannequin is suspicious. Hmm? <laughs> what is this? What? Where's my gun? I brought a gun in. I did not bring a gun in? Where'd my gun go? Stop grabbing me! Stop! Oh, they're just gonna chain grab me? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, stop grabbing! Oh my god. Fuck off with the grabbing. Fuck you. Fuck off. Oh. 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 You just watched me break your friend's arm as... He grabs me, and then you follow it up by grabbing me? You think that's a smart move? Oh, I didn't that far Sorry, I need to... I'm, I know you just knocked me down, but uh, don't mind me eating this. Ooh! Ow, that hurt.
Fuck off. Fuck off with your wand. It's just like everyone has super armor. Dummy. Ooh, you knocked the stick away. Now I can walk through. Oh, he's running? Okay. Hold on. Zero? Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me the stick. You're all gonna learn. Your first mistake was giving me a stick. Oh fuck, he's got brass knuckles. None of these guys got the grappler stance, so we're good. Alright, have this. Nope, nope, nope. to be. Doesn't matter. Just big puncho left. Oh, never mind. He's got one of his minions. I'm pretty sure he's the can't be grab size. Which also means there's like no heat moves I can do against him. They just also don't go down. There we go. We're gonna, uh, just... Uh, health. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then we're gonna grab this. Slimes. Ooh. Excuse me, why does the barricade not give me heat? That's the way. That's also the wrong way. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Fuck, you got a new stick. Ah, shit. That's a good one. I gotta keep that one in mind. Oh. But I can do that again, I think, if I have the heat for it, which I don't have now. the dumb way. Giving them super armor. Oh, my gosh. 
Like, the, this guy's the mini boss because he just has super armor in his movement. That's it. Great. Like, that's it. That's all he's got. He just has super armor on one attack. Look, there it is. Super armor. Like, I don't have the ability to cancel out of my own moves fast enough to deal with a super armor like that, you know? Of course you did. Now I have the stick. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Give me your gun. My gun. Suzumiya, let's go. Guess what I got? Wait, what? Oh, he's got a shotgun. Okay. Do the like roll roll. I mean, like, he's not doing anything, he didn't put up a fucking fight. Ugh. Uh, we'll just take this. This up. Where's the shotgun? There it is. Yeah, I don't know how to do a roll versus just a quick tip, you know? Oh, it's double tap, okay. Duh. Wait, who's... Who has a teeny bit of health? Yeah, what? Fuck you. Hey, come on. Anyway. Back to the problem at hand. Oh, my inventory is too full of junk. I should have sent the watch back, actually. Um. Where? Where am I supposed to go? When it, oh, okay. Wait, you're back? I. Mm. My gun! I just threw it! No! Guys, like, you want me to show you how to use a shotgun? You just ignore other people's bullets. <laughs> oh, great! Stop! with the gun. Oh, he just can't, can't do anything when he's just shooting you in the back with a shotgun. Is there fucking more of them?
Stop! I didn't want to do that. I want to do like instant transmission, but you know what? We'll take it. Come on, you're going down. I want to keep the shotgun. I want to keep the shotgun. Go down. Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, this is doing no damage to him. Fine. Get up. Get up. Okay, I didn't need to keep the shotgun. Oh well. Oh! Maybe I do. This should get me closer to the roof. Where's my shotgun? Oh my god. Yeah, oh, okay. the gun. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. a fucking sledgehammer on the guy. All right. Guy behind this. What do you think? Come on, Nago, stand up. Oh, he blocked it. There we go. That's how you do it. Give me your sword. Aizawa, oof. Come on, stand up. Okay, you're just not gonna stand up. Am I, is this, am I in a maze? I'm in a fucking maze? Oh, okay, cool. We're back to regular fighting. Yeah! It's my favorite one. Aside from the fucking flip, but I mean... Uh... Come on, come on! And you're done. Alright. Who's- Oop! I'd better have taken him out, yeah. But I mean... Don't forget that like these people are like immortal. And the music is gone, okay. Was this the way I came? I cannot tell. This is not the way I came.
And one more for good. Nope, nope that's all I want to do. One more for good measure. Right in the nuts. Not that thing. Alright. Where am I going? I'm just in a maze. Last cage of emotions. Got there without getting touched. Did you fucking see that? Like, he grabbed it out of the air? Okay, we go through this door, I guess. No, we don't go through the door. This door? Oh! Okay, you're gone. Uh, this door. Nope. Wait. Nope, this is the way I- that's the sledgehammer I threw before. Kiryu is most terrifying when he's lost. Yeah. Okay, we got a little hammer. A little donkey hammer. We're gonna my short one. That dude's going for long blunt. Oof. Best one! Fuck. Okay, they just did do it. And, okay. Want that? I don't want that. What is with this dude's back? He looks like me. He's all hunched over. I don't think that's a fighting style, man. I know they say like you know get low, but okay, 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 okay. Stop. And then the music gets slow again. Where is my nice health restore? Ooh, right, the curry. We'll just eat both of the curry packs. And then we get going. Alright, how many more goons are there? There were only 18, I thought. Get ready, your arm is gone. Oh, but never mind, you're fucking dead is what it is. Okay, you're just, you're just gone. Uh, get this, eat that, grab this. Toughness Infinity. Oop. Okay. Even more. That dude's got a huge pull, and he's like bashing his buddies in the kneecaps with it. Shoof. Shoof. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's do this. Who's the one left?
Why did you make a, a, a fucking like sharp slash noise? He hit me with a pole. Yes! And he's down too, and we're back to the boring calm music. Oh, it's putting me to sleep, this music. This way. What? Why? Why put a prompt there? Great, the dark room! Someone's got a gun. Oof! Sorry, buddy! But you're dead! It was this one? This is your own fault for hiding in the corner with a gun! It's not honorable of you. And the gun phased through the wall, I guess, because I don't get to pick it up. That or it's this thing. It is this thing. Bop, bop. Your guns suck, guys. Oh! Okay. He's just real angry at me. He will not let up. Okay, I thought I finished him off, but I guess I cannot. Stop, just just calm down. And you're done. Please, is that it? I finished off the goons in the dark room? No. No, we still have the slow music. Find a key? Why? Why? Why did they need me to do that? Just open the door. Oh, it's snowing now. What is with this third fight introduction's cuts? Oh my gosh. I have fought like 15 people. Oh, it's all the bosses! Okay. Well, we're, I know which one we're dealing with first. Nope. Okay, nope, nope, nope. You. Sorry, I need to deal with him first. How about you fuck off? Okay, I need to. He's gonna shoot me right here. So we're gonna just pop this. Yeah, I thought so. Instant transmission. I hit the button! Excuse me, I am trying to hurt your shotgun buddy here. Fucking calm down! You stop! Okay, he's gone. Zoe is now on my lap. Okay, we grab this. Fuck you. Fuck you.
He's done. I wanted to shoot that one. Okay, I might have shot. Him. Hold on. Zoe, that is not where you sit. Not right now. Thank you. Sit, yep, right there. Perfect. Yep. Good girl. Yep. There you go. Good girl. There we go. He's gone. Just the one left. Uh, he's got- hold on. You actually got a point, hold on. Uh, there's so many points now. All of these. That's it. It's all I have is those fours. So what did I get? Quick step while not in heat mode. Activated in heat mode. And... Depletes heat gauge but replenishes health if I'm in heat mode. Okay. Let's see what that looks like. If I get the chance. I don't think I'm doing anything. Oh, I should have Y. Can you? I'm trying to grab him. Cannot grab. He just. He's just dodging. He's just doing dodges. Oh great! He just impossible to grab. Okay, cool. Come on. Oh, when health is flashing? Okay. This guy kind of just sucks to fight. I'm not even facing the right way half the time. Okay, hold on. Fuck this guy. Fuck you. Fuck me. Eat a pole. Ugh. Better hurry to the roof. Oh, they're all gonna fight me for round two, huh? Alright, where's my hundred billion? I don't see it. Where's the fucking vault? This music is like the ending of Amazing Race or something. It's like, oh, which team's gonna get to the finish line first? We are showing both, and it looks like they could either, but like one team is an hour ahead of the other. <laughs> Holy fuck, I wasn't expecting you to show up, Kiryu. What the fuck? <laughs> ゲームは終わりだ。取引に応じろ。まあいいだろう。約束だからな。俺は男気はないが、真偽は守るよ。あいつ、
Oh, great. Ah, right. You did not fight my top goon. The traitor. お前がひどか。桐生和馬さんですね。こうしてお会いできるなんて光栄です。さあ役者は揃った。それじゃそろそろ取引に入ろう。ああ。物々交換としよう。Or what? Yeah, that's not going to happen. Dude, like... Does everyone know that Kiryu is like a stupid pushover when it comes to stuff like this? They're like, yeah, no, he's honest to a fault. Now, what's the bad thing that's gonna happen? Her hand is clipping through her fucking dress. Like, yeah, he's a fool. You think we're gonna trade a file for a hundred billion and two people? Yeah, you should have. Ah, new love interest. Yeah, like, uh, he's right. You really think that's gonna be with okay? We had a deal! You hit him on, like, the wrong side of his chest. He's wearing a bulletproof vest. I can tell already. He's wearing one. Come on, I want to fight on top of it. Katsuraki-san, I thought I was going to get rid of my friend's friend. Friend, this is... I'm sorry, I'm sorry. 
よくやったな軌道ヒリュウカズマさんですね。東条会柴田組、金村工業若頭の新井です。こうしてお目にかかれて光栄です。何をふざけたこと言ってんだお前、自分が何をしているのか分かってんのかお前は今、自分の兄弟を裏切ったんだぞ。それがどんなことか分かってんのかええ、分かってます。十分なほどにね。おやらい登場会はお前に渡さねえ。何があろうと。俺が食い止めてやる。いいな。遅すぎるんですよ。あなたはいつも遅すぎる。I mean, he's got a point. Like, this is happening partially because he, like, Kiryu went, No, I don't want to be part of the Yakuza anymore. And, like, they're like, Okay, this, you can't go and say anything about this. Like, you left, basically. You're, you've been running an orphanage. You're not here to help until it's too late. I knew it. No, Keith. Naito. Oh, my no, you're a cuss. Coros Kimos, eh? He's sure so good in Italy. Are you are you serious? Her walking towards you is too much. <laughs> oh, 
Oh right, they handed her that revolver. You guys didn't check her for a gun? None of you checked her for a gun? You just bound her hands and gagged her and that's it. You called it a day. Yeah, no, it's like a quarter of these things are kind of hand waved away as complete incompetence. You know, that is a good point. Why would a girl have a gun? Alright, now let's go get the 100 bill, please. Yes, go! So we can, like, fund our adventures. Yes, go! Yes, go! Yes, go! Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Sure. Oi! Okay. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. It's one of those things where they're trying to make me care about a character. But they have set the precedence that A, uh, Kiryu does not know what a romance is, and the only time he's had a romance, they went and shipped him away a game later. Shipped her away a game later and went, no, 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 no love for you. It's bad, bad Yakuza man. And like, every single time we have tried to interact with her, or tried to keep her safe, or tried to help her, she has gone and made the situation worse by not listening to whatever protagonist is in the scene at the time. Uh, What's-His-Face was, like, work at the club, and she fucked off for a bit uh, after, like, getting the money. Uh, the cop was like, okay, we're gonna help you, you know, we found where it is. She just leaves it before him. And then Kiryu's like, okay, just stay in the fucking bar because shit's going down, something's wrong. And then she drugs the host and runs away. Like... Why? I don't feel sympathy. I don't feel like I, I, I'm not. I didn't get connected to her because it was just. I could see her death coming, the moment it was like, oh wait, they're in the same room. Yeah, no, she's dead. But so now the entire rest of the game is going to be, the four stooges up against the corrupt cops who have worked their way into the Tojo clan. But, I mean, the answer to that there was, what's her face? Pull out the revolver and shoot that, like, shoot a rye. He is, like, the, the pinnacle of basically, and ev an like, he's evil in your eyes. He's anti-everything you're standing for. And you then you have five more bullets for revenge. <sighs> oh, whatever. Whatever. All right, we're gonna call it here for today. We're gonna call it with this one. Um, man, whatever. The game is still better than some of the other ones by like a long shot, right? Like it is still above three by like a drastic amount. Um, yeah. So my plan is Yakuza next Monday, all right? I'm not going to be streaming Savage just because we don't really have a super 100% set schedule for it right now. 
it's kind of just like up in the air of what days when. So it's just going to be stream whenever stream for Yakuza. Um, or it's going to be raid for whenever we raid. I'm not going to deal with setting it up every time. So Monday, barring crazy weather again, Yakuza, 7 or 8 p.m. starting. But until then, thank you everyone for coming out. Thank you for, you know, coming to have fun. Uh, enjoy the rest of your week. Enjoy your weekend. And I will see you guys on Monday, all right? All right, cool. Uh, take care.